Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. It is Wednesday, it is 5 p.m. and I am stuck in traffic. There will definitely won't be a Vlogmas Day 8 today because, honey, I am exhausted. I started working at 9 a.m. this morning. I did wound care today. I saw uh 35 patients at the end of the day i went to two facilities and today was just too much it was team too much it was too much going on i am not done with charting so i'm gonna go home and do the notes the first building i still have four or five patients that i need to chart on they're new consulted patients so i have to go do the notes for them and then for the second building i think i have two new consults to do not a ton load of notes which is amazing i was really trying my best to knock out the notes as i went along even um even the second building actually had i actually did two of the consulting notes at the second building because i was just like i just don't want to go home with so much you know so definitely i cannot post any videos today i know you guys understand it's kind of a lot that i'm trying to take on but you know what i'll do is just add today and tomorrow because definitely was that i wasn't lying but today and tomorrow i will add those two days and then that video will go up tomorrow all right i will see you guys for vlogmas day nine can promise Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Hello guys, good morning, good morning, happy vlogmas day 9, I wash my hands and stuff in the gym but still I have to you know sanitize a little, it's 11am on the dot and I just did a workout, I feel so so good. I decided that I'm not working today. This is why I'm at the gym, <laughs> you know. I was supposed to, I told you guys that I'm, suppo I'm supposed to be covering my boss for the next three weeks because he's on vacation. And one of the buildings that I'm supposed to round at for wound rounds, I dropped the paperwork off for them. And I used to round there before, so I've had clearance at that building before. My thing has expired and they said they want new updated Things. of course they want my license Let's fill out all the packet all of this all of that TB testing whatever they want malpractice insurance I'm like I work for so-and-so his stuff is there I'm on his malpractice insurance so then I called the lady in HR and she said well we need an updated TB your TB whatever so I said, when is that going to happen? Because I'm supposed to run on Thursday. That's not going to happen. I don't normally do the skin TB test because I was vaccinated before for TB. Anytime I do the skin test, it reacts like I have TB. And the funny thing is when I first moved to America, I had a TB test done when I was getting like one of my first little jobs. And they told me I had TB and I was freaking out. I remember calling my mom like, I have TB. Mom, I have TB. I don't know why these people keep calling me but and they were about to start me on the six months regiment of the rifampane and all the tb medication and my mom was like do not fill that prescription you do not have tb uh they need to just do your chest do a chest x-ray can you imagine anyways so i told them that i'm supposed to do a chest x-ray i call my 
primary care physician they got back to me last night and said that not last night at the end of day yesterday that she did went ahead and order the x-ray so I need to go to get x-ray done so you guys you know what I said I'm not working today I'm just gonna take a mental health day because I need it and I don't care <laughs> I do not care a couple of other stuff is going on behind the scenes that I don't even want to speak on um, but yeah that's the gist of the story and but yeah workout was great I did 30 minutes on the treadmill but I really was only walking because number one I didn't put on the proper bra situation to run <laughs> this is not a one that struck them down if you ladies know what i mean this is too flimsy and then i did the ellipticals for like 10 minutes to run my cardio to like 40 minutes and then i went and did some back workout slowly i'm getting myself back into working out because yeah i need it i need it and i feel good when i work out as well um, i'm gonna run to hobby lobby because hobby lobby is literally up the street and see if i can find anything else because my christmas tree need a few a few other things i'm just starting up my car my christmas tree need a few other things and i want to run in there real quick to see if they have any of the stuff that i already bought to put on the tree and then i'm gonna head home That's it. It's a bus. They don't have anything in here. So I'm gonna run into I'm gonna run into home goods because I have something in my in that I forgot I have to return. So let's do that. So I'm back home and I didn't find nothing my Christmas tree is just gonna have to be that way it's gonna have to just stay that way for this year until next year that I I go earlier and find more stuff for the tree because it doesn't make sense for me to go go anywhere and try to find anything else I'm not gonna find nothing else the stores are dry and bare and there's nothing there now I just got a phone call from a social worker from one of the buildings that I need to call a patient's family member a patient is being discharged and it's just a whole ring him a row situation oh lord all right i'll catch you guys up so so good because i'm trying to get back into you know my weight loss stuff i'm doing intermittent fasting so it's 12 30 and i just broke my fast and i'm breaking my fast with a cup of coffee i use heavy cream sugar-free syrup and i don't have any mct oils i am going to drink my coffee and I have been getting text messages and phone calls so I'm going to sit down open a computer for a little bit do a little bit of work let me let me say this last night when I came home I was charting and I think I still have one more note to do because I they didn't upload any patient record for that one patient yet let's do a little bit of work shall we Oh, let me make sure you can't see the people in business, honey, because that's HIPAA.
got back home now. It's 4.30. As you saw, I went to do the chest x-ray, stopped at the post office to check my P.O. box, and I had a certified letter that came to my house, and I was supposed to go pick it up a week ago, and I didn't pick it up. <laughs> so I ha had to pick that up, and I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to call it a day. Today was, I didn't do nothing. I sat down on the couch around my kitchen table and I was catching up on my shows I was watching this show on Netflix that my husband introduced me to told me that it's pretty good it's called imposters so I was catching up on that also I was watching the love and marriage Huntsville reunion do you guys watch that show oh my goodness I'm obsessed with it I stopped watching the housewives and I started watching that but Huntsville is a hot mess but this reunion it's starting off with a banger anyways that is it for today cuz I ain't doing nothing else I'm about to cook some chicken stir-fry for the fam and I'll see you guys tomorrow bye